Hey y'all, welcome back. I want to share some information regarding bilateral CTAs of the arms, upper extremity. Here we go. This picture here is from radiologykey.com. I just Googled it. This image came up and here it is, radiologykey.com. Thank you for the image. And I wanted to show that there's a CTA here. Remember, there is an angiogram, so the contrast is going in really fast, about four or five milliliters per second, because we want the arterial phase of this, and it's getting bilateral arms. If the patient can, we want their arms to be above their head and not on the chest part, because the chest is more mass that it needs to go through, um, and it'll most likely get artifact or their arms won't even fit into one scan and one run. That means we have to give them more radiation or um, scan them twice because it might be cut off. So we like this because it is pretty much getting including both arms. Um, you can see the blood flow going all the way towards the hand and it's beautiful. But my whole point to this, and I wanted to share because I did run into an issue before. So where does the contrast go if we're looking at both arms? So from what it looks like here, the IV was, oops, the IV was probably on this side. Um, if I were to take a wild guess that's how it kind of looks like I'm not really sure but the whole point of this is because I ran into the situation a doctor ordered a scan they wanted both the left and the right side of the arm they both want to see the blood flow of both arms and they put the nurse had put two IVs one on the left the right side and one on the left side so they had bilateral um, IV access but the rule of thumb is if we want the left side we put the IV on the opposite side the right side and if our area of interest is the right side then the IV would be on the left side but what happens when you have two arms that you want and the IVs on both arms and then you want to not give them at that much contrast because one um, too much contrast can be bad for the kidneys because the kidney has to work to kind of get it out, filter it out of the system. Um, two, we will have to scan them twice, so more radiation. Um, so we want to kind of avoid that. Um, but what I learned recently, and this is the reason for this video and I want to share, is that... Um, when you do have a bilateral CTAs, and I learned this through an ASRT um, module, I believe it was module 10, I could be wrong, but one of the modules for ASRT, it said if we do have two CTAs for bilateral arms, we can use an IV on the foot. So the IV can place be placed on the patient's foot so that there's nice contrast arterial flow going all the way to both arms and there's no artifacts from contrast entering the arms because if it's contrast coming from one side of the arm then it's going to compromise the image and obscure some of the things that the radiologist needs to see so the whole point is um that we can use an IV on the foot. Just make sure that it's a high rated IV, so most likely at least a 20 gauge. And you might wanna delay the contrast a little more because it's gonna take time to go from the foot all the way up and hit the arm. And you want our, our, our um, locator or SNV, scan in view, to be like where the elbow is. Um, and of course, if there's any artifacts and stuff between that, then you don't want to get it. But yeah, that's what I wanted to share. We can put an IV on the foot for a bilateral CTA of the arm. Voila. <sighs>
that was so exciting because I did run into that. I couldn't get a hold of a radiologist. And so we ultimately did scan them one at a time, which sucked. And the patient was in pain. The patient couldn't bring their arms up. But now I know that if they do have an interest of bilateral arms, IV can go on the foot. Yes. So there you are. Thanks for watching. I hope you take some information from this. Again, share your thoughts if you have any. If I am incorrect in something, please let me know. If there's something you want to add, please leave it on the comment. And of course, follow me on my regular YouTube channel, Kamani on Earth, or my Instagram at kamani.d12. Thank you. Toodles. Noodles. Peace.